Youth activism is on the rise and increasingly social media is becoming one of the main devices in the Young Activist Toolbox to spread a message to a global audience. Greta Thunberg, the 16-year-old environmental activist from Sweden, has become a key figure in the climate change dialogue. You all come to us young people for hope. How dare you? Ahead of the UN Climate Summit, millions took part in climate strike protests inspired by Greta and her Fridays for Future campaign. What began as a lone protest outside the Swedish parliament became a mass movement of around 4 million people in 1,000 cities around the world. But Greta is just the most high profile example. Around the world, many young people are using social media to speak out and build a following. On her 15th birthday, Leah Namugewa talked locals in her hometown in Uganda into helping to plant 200 trees. Let's all celebrate our by trees. Her campaign to ban plastic is steadily gaining support on social media, but she has seen some resistance from the government. Her first main protest was blocked on May the 15th, and on another occasion, a fellow striker was chased from outside Parliament during a strike, and his placard was confiscated. When she was 10 years old, the family of Sunita Alizadeh tried to sell her into marriage in her native Afghanistan. The plan fell through when her family fled the country to escape the Taliban, but the problem did not go away. At 16 years of age, her mother asked her to return to Afghanistan to marry a man willing to pay for her. She saw YouTube as an online outlet that would give volume to her message. <laughs> And it worked. Her song, Daughters to Sell, picked up over 1.4 million views. But young activists can also challenge the establishment from inside. Syed Sadiq is Malaysia's youngest cabinet minister at 26 and uses social media to advocate for change. The government must walk the talk. He has successfully had the voting age reduced from 21 to 18 and has launched a campaign to demand the government pay for internships. Tadi semasa mesyuarat Jumaat Menteri, saya telah pun membangkitkan pentingnya untuk rakan-rakan kabinet memberikan prioriti utama pada isu-isu anak muda yang sekarang ini telah pun jadi isu-isu nasional. Social media has provided activists like this with a stage to reach millions around the world. Twitter is now the social network in which a greater political activism is displayed, but Facebook has a greater potential audience and the option to publicise events allows for movements like Greta's strike to take place simultaneously in multiple locations for maximum impact. But this level of exposure also exposes activists to criticism and even threats online. Some say that Greta is the figurehead of a giant PR stunt and the backlash against her has reached extreme levels. Young activists going online signals a new generation of activism that shows no sign of slowing down or going away anytime soon.